Hello, it is I, Hamster of Wrath, back again with some more Ghost of Tsushima. Um, hopefully... <laughs> we've got like a ton of uh, work going on outside. I'm kind of hoping they don't cut through the power lines or anything like that. So we'll have to see how it goes. And we've got guys working on the roof next door, so um, hopefully you won't hear any of this. Uh, as I've got my filters set to lovely things, but there we go. So let's get back into it. Ah... This is all the glory of having headphones on, you see. I can't hear most of it. Okay, what do we do? I think we just rescued the sake. That was Oh no, it was the food, wasn't it? The food was the last thing we did. So there is a undiscovered location, literally 90 meters in this direction. So let's go have a look. <laughs> just felt like doing that. No reason. Uh, oh, it's a survivor camp. Okay. There's quite a few of those around. Any side quests? Okay, I've got to, I gotta remember what the buttons are. Five, five is sheath sword. Is six clean it or is it seven? If six is bell. Seven is clean sword, I think. Yeah, yeah, I'm flicking the sword like a madman. <laughs> Didn't break my legs. Good work. Okay, nobody appears to have any side quests. Trade but good to know. Times, uh, I don't think we can afford any more upgrades. Let's have a quick look. Uh, ooh, we can up the explosive arrows. I mean, why Only wouldn't you, really? For you. Only the best. Thank you. I'm sure. Well, we won't tell him about the bits where we hilariously land on our own heads or something uh, rather unfortunate. Right, there's a couple of uh, undiscovered bits. Also, there's another outpost there. Um, well, it's going to give me some steel. Fallen outpost. Oh, okay, so it's not like a major one. Um, yeah, let's let's backtrack a little bit. There's a lot of places to explore in this game. Good lord. It's an open world game. I mean, really. If you didn't have lots to do, it'd be very boring. Wait, hang on. Oh, no, that's the fishing village. Okay. Don't say, we already discovered that. We shall skirt around that. Largely, as I said, my horse doesn't do very well in uh, confined spaces. It's quiet. Too quiet. Wait, this is sending me... This is sending me around the coast? Okay, uh, I don't think I can use boats. Also, my horse is not very aquatic, so I'm going to have to double back a little bit there. <laughs> not very aquatic. That implies my horse is somewhat aquatic, which is not the case. It is very not aquatic. Sending me like the other side of the I mean that's the sea. I can't go in that direction. Okay, let's just check this map again. What have I what have I messed up here? Oh, it's literally to my left. Ah, oh, there it is. Oh, it's a haiku station. That's what I'm calling them now. They're now haiku stations. Yes, hello bird. I can see the haiku station. Sutsu haiku. Okay. Let's see how badly I can cock this one up. What are you? What are we meditating on today? On death. Oh, okay. This would be hardcore. Okay, what are we? What are we starting with here? Yep, I am using it to look around. Oh, never-ending flow. Doesn't sound very deathly. Basked in peace, we rest. I mean, that sounds like a good start. Worry, strangle, growth. No, I'm going to go with. Uh, Fast in peace we rest. That sounds good. Fast in peace we rest. Unafraid defenders stand. That doesn't really follow on. The earth's cold grasp underneath. I mean, that does follow. Bit depressing, but does follow. Yeah, okay, well, let's, let's stick with that. And what are our options for the last one? Run from a broken past. 
Not only the mouse doesn't like this, flourishing and free. Okay, let's say grown from a broken past. I think that's more fitting. Very depressing haiku. As you'd expect about death. Basked in peace, we rest. The earth's cold grasp underneath. Grown from broken past. Ain't not my best work, but also probably not my worst. The headband of death. Okay, we gotta have a look at that. Oh wow, that really is the headband of death. Good lord. <laughs> uh, actually fits in quite well with the rest of the outfit. Actually, I'm gonna change my mask. Actually, 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 what do we got? Here is Tsushima Thieves Wrap Samurai Clan mask. We can change colors. Oh, we can change the colour of the string. Okay. Oh, we can make it red. Oh, there we go. Now I now I look like a... <laughs> yeah, now I definitely look like you don't want to mess with me. Good lord. Um, okay. All things here. Something's bluff. I didn't actually see that. Exile's bluff? Sounded like that. Where are you, horse? I'm hither! Yoink! <laughs> I do like little touches like that. You can look and jump on the horse while it's moving. Uh, okay, it says go up. Okay, so we have to go around this way, I guess. Oh, I'm stuck between two trees. Hmm, can we get up there on the horse? That's the question. I'm gonna go with no. So let's go with the climbing option. Oh, fail. There we go. I was playing Ghost Streak on the other night with the uh, Chaos collab, and it was kind of like, ah, curse you, muscle memory. There we go. Uh, can we resummon horse? Let's resummon horse. Here. See, the horse can climb the hills faster than I can. It's kind of funny. Is this going to be a shrine, I wonder? Might be a shrine. Whoops. That's my keyboard, uh, keyboard desk. I really need to fix that. I need to take that put some screwdrivers to it. Uh, put a screwdriver to it and tighten up the bolts and stuff. Oh, we're nearly there. Like a gazelle! Though I don't think gazelles are very good at climbing. Maybe they are. I don't know. Not really something I put a lot of research into. This is... What is this? A fox den? Of course it would be. Hello. Lead on, Mr. Fox. We're going all the way back down this mountain. I'm not going to be very impressed. We, we, no. Oh, okay. Fox is more agile than I am. Film at 11. I must admit, these used to be, I used to think these would be quite difficult, but, but like the first one we ever did was quite difficult, and every single one has been really straightforward since. But the important thing is, can we pet the fox? This is the, this is the important question. Is the fox still there? No! The fox has buggered off. Boo! I was denied a fox petting opportunity. Um... Okay, so let's set our sights on that outpost. The campfire down there, I don't remember that being there earlier. Can I get down there without breaking my neck? Probably not. Wait, how do I get back? I got up here. Oh, I've squeezed through the hole. Yeah, I completely forgot. It was like 30 seconds ago and I completely forgot. Random campfire. That is very random. Well, actually, it's very specific in a very random place, but... Nothing actually here. It's just... Abandoned. Oh, well. Find his keepers. Uh, am I going in the wrong direction again? I think the wind is blowing in the complete polar opposite direction. Yeah, it's sort of that way. Oh, there is a dude on a horse. Is that a patrol? Could be a patrol. I need the practice. Get completely sidetracked, as we always do. Which I always think is a good feature in a game if you get sidetracked. It means there's lots to do.
Oh, okay. Oh, okay, we have a prisoner. Hmm. So how do we do this without the prisoner getting killed, I wonder? Carefully would be the answer to that one, I guess. Okay, dude on a horse. Uh, no, I want my big bow. Go with a... Actually, I have a horrible feeling if I start. Hmm. I mean, hopefully they'll think I'm the bigger threat, but we'll find out in a minute. Wow, not dead. Oh, wow, we had my number. I'm in the wrong start. Hang on. Come on, then. Whoops. Wind stunts. Oh, yes. I'm in the wrong stance again. That's fine. This guy's dead anyway. What, are you insisting? Oh my god. That was also the wrong stance. Oh no, it's not. Right. The boot to the head technique. Very effective. Oof. So when you get stabbed. Oops. It is that little short stab they do. It's a little tricky to know when it's gonna land, I gotta say. I mean, possibly I didn't wiggle the camera around so much, I'd see it coming, but. <laughs> oh, good, she's alive. I could have gone a little smoother. soon unless i miss with a knife at which point you'll probably bleed to death thank goodness you're safe now please this is for you supplies or not supplies uh what you give me all 50 supplies nice oh okay so we actually had to go up the top there that guy's horse was very, very bright. Might steal it. Don't let me. I'm saving my own horse. He's he's having a rest. Oh, it was Exile's Bluff. I figured that would be a fitting name. I just I saw it obscured on the map and I was thinking, I bet that's called Exile's Bluff. Right, okay, I don't think horse can uh it's going to be much use from this point forward. Oh, there was a corner I could have gone around. Never mind. All right, am I heading the right way? I think so. Oh, where is it? Oh, it's Luala. Ah, oh, okay. Well, let's approach on foot. Then we can be a bit sneaky. When I say a bit sneaky, I mean I'm, I'm literally saying a tiny, tiny bit sneaky. Alright, I want to be talking about defences. Okay, dude on the tower. Good start. How many arrows have I got left? Ugh. Oh, we got three of the big arrows. Oh my, they didn't have any archers. I was like, nobody dropped any arrows. I was like, yep, that's because they didn't have any archers. We can take that guy out. Okay, there's no one looking at him. Okay, let's try that. He's a little distance away. No one suspects a thing. Wait, did he fall off? Wait, they're fighting something. What are they fighting? It looks like they're already having a scrap. Somebody else got here before me? That was weird. They're fighting something. I can't actually tell what. What happened here? I mean, I don't think this battle is ongoing. I think everyone... Oh, yeah, no, this guy's not very well. What is... 
Okay, I'm a little baffled. The Mongol leader is already injured. What? What transpired here? Because bad guys are mostly dead. I'm perplexed. Maybe they didn't have it all their own, all their own way. Who knows? All right, can I observe him? Am I close enough? There we go. He's got like a tiny fraction of his health, so I don't know what happened there. Maybe there was an explosion? I don't know. Kill enemies undetected without focused hearing. Oh, interesting. Okay. Alt X, challenge remaining enemies. Well, no, I don't want to do that. I want to try and be undetected. Okay, there's a dude. Oh, oh wait, it says kill while being undetected. It didn't necessarily specify how I could kill them. And also I missed, and I'm probably detected now. Yep, well that's gone out the window, isn't it? Yep! Oh, it reset. Oh, yeah, no, that's just epic fail. Epic fail across the board. Was that it? Oh, well, that was never gonna happen, because there's only two guys left, so... That's... I was expecting this to be a much harder fight. I don't quite know what's happened here. Maybe they clearly didn't have it all their own way. I don't know. There's these guys, look at this. There's three guys here who are dead. Mystery. All right, yeah, I'm, I'm not seeing anything else here. How odd. It looked like somebody did half the job for me there. Very strange. Uh, now the looting begins. I also saw my pet bird outside. I wonder if he's going to show me anything interesting. Where'd he go? Come on, plot bird, where are you? No? He's vanished. No idea. I'm pretty sure you can actually stab people through these windows if they're, if they're standing close with their back to it. I've never actually done it before. Because usually they're up. Hopefully you didn't hear that. Usually they're too alerted by that point. There's so much work going on outside. It's really quite funny. Well, was that it? Have I literally have I liberated this place? Yes, I have. Okay, that was... That was remarkably easy. Oh, iron. Excellent. We need that. Heavy arrows. Good. I wonder how many more um, things we need before we can upgrade the katana again. What is my bird telling me? Right, here you are, bird. What, what are you telling me? Iron? Are you telling me about the iron? Yes, you are. Well done. Now where are you going? Just bug it off. Honestly, as a compass, this bird is the most inconsistent thing in the universe. I feel you would probably get lost. Well, more lost. I don't know where it was sending me. Right, I am largely scouring for iron now. Oh, so these... Oh, okay, so if we got here earlier, there must have been, like, an active fight happening. It's so weird, I didn't really pick up on that. Oh, well. Oh, steal the wind chime. Oh, some more iron on the floor. I just... I just oh, no, that's water. <laughs> it's like... Oh, the iron's on the floor. No, that's water. 
can really do with a torch. I know I've got my Batman vision, but I think a torch would be also useful. Uh, oh, more iron. Excellent. And again. I must be getting close to an upgrade. I mean, okay, there was a forge there. I can forgive it just randomly having iron littered around the forge. That makes more sense. Um, Pretty sure that's everything. Yeah, how close are we to another upgrade? Uh, Sakai Steel upgrade. Oh, I'm one iron away from an upgrade. God damn. Right, now we, now we have to have a look. This always happens. There must be one bit of iron left here. Come on. Just one more iron. Give it to me. Oh, that's ammo. In this way. That's an outhouse. Find iron in the outhouse. That's really weird. It's a rock. Come on, game. I just need one more iron. No. Denied. Oh, well. Actually, thinking about it, you can actually buy iron. I keep forgetting the merchants actually have some. What is this sodding bird trying to tell me? What bird? That's, that's a wall. Go over the wall? Okay. Now where? Better leads from iron. Where are you taking me? Also, why am I not using my horse? I tell you, the other thing I appreciate about this game is that you don't have a stamina bar, so you can just run as long. Okay, you can run a little bit. Oh, collect! It's a hat. Wanderer's straw hat. Have I not already got one of those. Got a swordmaster's hat and a wanderer's straw hat. Oh, wow, I can look like an absolute lunatic wearing that. Now, now I look. Now I actually do look like a Dark Souls villain. <laughs> I can't see shit. How can I actually see out of that? That's impressive. I I don't like that. If I'm gonna wear something goofy on my head, I'm gonna wear the other the other uh, the other straw hat. You can actually see out of that one. One iron short. One iron. Oh, standoff. Oh, wait, hang on. There's something I haven't picked up there. What's that? So I know about the fallen outpost. That I'm interested in. Right, once we've handled the Mongols, maybe there's some... Oh, there's iron here. That'd be great. Hello, sir. About to get stabbed by a bush. Alright, I assassinated him from the front. That is not the smartest thing I've done. Apparently his buddy didn't know us. Wait, have I still got the stealth charms equipped? Because that'd be really silly if I have. Oh, no, no, it's all the melee stuff. Good. Now, if I shank this guy, will the other guy notice? Apparently not. Here you Dishonorable, but fast. Right, he's looking straight at him. I do just love you can just change between assassin and warrior at the drop of a hat if you so feel like it. I do like that. Oh, I see singing crickets. Oh, okay, the singing crickets are in the graveyards. Okay. I mean, how they teach me to play the flute, I have no idea, but don't question it. Am I going to assassinate all of these guys? I'm starting to believe. Maybe I'll challenge the last guy to a fight just for a giggle. Oh, he's an archer. Okay. That's that's not going to be much of a fight.
Point blank. Try again. <laughs> I love that skill. Oh, it is a mighty skill. I am also keep being in the wrong stance for fighting people, which is quite funny. Uh, unlikely to be ironed in the graveyard, is there? Be nice if there was, but I don't think there will be. Wow, I killed the daylights out of that guy. Good lord. Right, okay. Uh, back this way. Okay. Actually, that's a good point. We could just go to the merchant, buy the iron from the merchant, um, and then go and upgrade it anyway. So, yep, yeah, that makes sense. Oh, wow, it's all the way up there? Okay. I can do this. Probably. Oh, there's a little squeezy hole. Do I need the squeezy hole? I don't know. Let's find out. Uh, I, oh, that's a grapple. That's a grapple up there. That's too high, though. Okay, I guess we're probably attacking that from the other side. Winding Mountain Shrine. There you go. It's a shrine. Excellent. Oh, can't see. Bushes. Wait, was there something glowing down there? Oh, it's a flower. Oh, flowers are important. Ah, now this we couldn't do unless we had the grapple hook, which we now do have. So that's lucky. Uh, me of creation. Okay. So let's do a uh, loop and zap and whoa hoo That would have that would have stung. Crashing into a cliff at full speed with only your legs to stop you. That's, that's gonna sting. Bamboo supplies, more supplies. No iron. Be nice if there was. Just need one iron. Uh, the bamboo is for the bows, I think. Right, so where do I go? I go from here. Flowers nearly threw myself off. Um... Right, let's grapple down. That won't help. That's where we jumped from. I'm sure there was another grapple point over there, but... Okay, let's try it. No, didn't, didn't quite make that. Wait, didn't quite make that. I mean, I missed it by about a country mile. <laughs> but that's fine. That's not going to get me up there. I'm sure there was another grapple point over here somewhere. Yeah, there's one there, but how do I... Hmm. Oh, there's another one there. No, that's that's the one I used. What am I missing here? That's too high for me to climb. Yeah. Can I not climb the bamboo? Nope, can't climb the bamboo. Ah! There is a hill. I love how the, like, the resigned sigh he gives as he's crawling around. It's quite funny. Uh, This looks to be heading the wrong way now. Uh, hmm. Interesting. Okay, can I grab this? Oh, there's a grapple hook there. Okay, just saw that. Oh, so actually, if you didn't have the grapple, they let you off. Oh, okay, there's another grapple there. Got it. I've never actually figured out how long the rope is, either. Linen... Um. Alright, there's another squeezy hole. Am I, am I still going the right way? I don't know, this hole is very confusing. Ah, 
Here we go. Hello. Oh, I'm getting I'm getting bold there. Um, there's no way to get up though. Huh? Am I missing? I'm not sure. Oh, crawl through. Got this one's involved. Bloody hell. I need like a little headlamp, which obviously haven't been invented yet. For quite a long time. Ah, here we go. Okay. Like, please tell me that didn't just get me back where I started, because that'd be really annoying. It is basically where I started, in a roundabout way. Oh no, okay, we're still going up. This is good. Um. Ooh. Oh, that's a tricky one. How do I... Oh, okay, like that. Got it. I nearly pulled the triple there. I just lost my, uh... Lost my nerve there. No, wait, this is just sending me... Oh, okay, right. <laughs> oh, God. I think. Hey, look at that. Good Lord, that was involved. Me and my silly hat will honor the shrine. Charm of Izanagi. Oh, that's a gold one. What does that do? Landing a headshot has a 40% chance to return an arrow. That's nice. What would I give that up for, though? Let's swap that for that one, actually. Uh, where'd it go? Oh, okay, so these are... these are. I did not realise this. I've only got two major charm... Uh, major charm slots. And these are all minor ones. Right. This makes a small amount of sense. Okay. Um. Okay, I mean, we're not taking a huge amount of damage at the moment. So let's see what else we've got. Stop hunting. There you go. Stop hunting quicker. That's a good thing. So I'm doing like a pseudo stealth. Not really slash warrior run, so I really wish I could have a, like a hang glider or something, I could just like yeet myself off here and uh, fly down, but alas though I do like the fact that, that you literally have the option, it's like, and you can go back by pressing E it's like, thank you game you're being too kind I don't remember all these dead people being down here or this is, this is not how I approached it that's not how I approached it, okay don't remember the dead people. Okay, handy. Um, so that's completely got us off uh, off track in its entirety. Um, right, is there a trapper in the temple though? Because there isn't a trapper in the temple, so I'd have to go to the trapper, buy the stuff, and then go and upgrade the sword of the temple. Right, okay. Let's do that. I think he sells iron. God knows I think I've got enough supplies for it. Let's have a look. All my goods are useful. All my goods are useful, except the ones that aren't. Oh no, it's the trapper, not the merchant. But the merchant sells things, the trapper doesn't. I mean the trapper sells things, the merchant doesn't. Doesn't make a huge is that iron? No, it's bamboo, god damn it. How can I help you? Uh ammo and resources. Hero, flaming arrow. Oh no, right, you can only find the the iron in the Mongol areas. That makes sense, actually. 
I don't know why I thought that. Come back if but you that's need okay. It, my lord. Anything to offer from your hunting? Uh, nope. I haven't been hunting very much. Well, I haven't been hunting the animals very much. People have been hunting plenty of. I probably need my horse at this juncture. Horse! I'm still laughing when he just says horse instead of the actual horse's name. But there we go. I've said that about eight times. I'm heading the right direction. I am not heading the right direction. Now I am. This is a bit of a question how many headshots I've actually got with the arrows. I don't know. Well, the bow. I mean, the arrow is the thing you hit them with, so I'd say that probably counts. Right, we should be able to find at least one iron in here. That'll make me happy. Okay. Uh, do they have any special objectives for me? Also, I have got a technique point to spend. What have we got? Delayed strike. Mounted strike. Resolved parry. Uh, what about my stances? Uh, three piercing strikes. I thought we already had that. Oh, interesting. Okay. Drown your foe with a flood of five rapid strikes. Mm, that could be fun. Automatically parry spear attacks during any wind stance attack. Okay, that's fun. Um, I'm going to go with that because I'm crap with spears. I think that's a good shout. Okay, assassinate enemies from above without being seen. Oh, that's going to be a... That's going to be tricky. That's going to be monumentally tricky. Right, they've got one... They've got two guys on a pole. So if I get one guy... Let's see if I can actually get a headshot with this. Probably not. Oh my god, I got a headshot and I got an arrow back. That's actually pretty cool. Okay, assassinate from above. That's gonna be that's gonna be awkward. Not impossible. But awkward. Right. So, if that guy's facing away... Oh, he's looking right at me. Okay, I can get up to the top there. Jump out and shank him. I don't think anyone else will see me. So let's try it. I mean, the amount of noise I'm making climbing this bamboo ladder has got nothing to do with it, but... Okay, one! Nearly bounced off the timber there. That would have been very embarrassing. Leaps out of the sky like a maniac, bounces off a wooden frame. <laughs> oh, I, can, I can always forget these, that we can sneak around under here as well. Okay. Is he inside the tent? Okay, he's inside the tent. That's awkward. I could use a wind chime. Okay, let's do the advanced class here. I think you'd notice if someone was on the roof. Right. Uh, one. Okay. Wind chime. Here you. Shit, that went further than I thought it would. That's two. Iron. Yes. Have a katana upgrade. Excellent. Right, just one more. Okay, there's a guy in the tower. He needs to go, because it'd be quite difficult to get high without him noticing me. So let's try that again. No, not wind chimes. Bow. That, that's that's the thing we want to use. Wait, is he coming in? Oh, no, okay. Did he fall off? He didn't fall off. That's good. 
because had he done, I think I probably would have given the game away. Right, where's this guy? He's there. Okay, so he's facing outwards. So if I got up the tower, I could probably get him. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't turn around, don't turn around, don't turn around. You don't want to see me crying. Oh, he nearly fell off. That was close. And that makes three. Nice. Okay, let's get rid of the dude next to the horse. Horse is completely unbothered, which makes me laugh. Maybe you didn't treat him very well. Right, that's the Liga. The, the Liga? It's the Liga. The leader, indeed. I can reclaim my wind chime. No, I don't want to stand off. I wish to observe him. There we go. I can't see him through this rock, but aside from that... I do love the fact you get two points for that. That's really quite useful. Okay, so you've got one guy fishing. The leader's there. Won't get him in one shot, but we can try. Surprise! Entirely the wrong stance. But he's dead. So that works. Right, both swords. Yep. Come on then, guys. Oh! I mean, I asked him to bring it, and he did. I have terrible tro trouble blocking that little jump they do. Patience. Okay, I think that was all the objectives. Nice, got eight iron out of that as well. That's nice. Okay, let the looting commence. Oh, I accidentally bowed. I wanted to clean my sword, but never mind. Luckily, I think my sword auto cleans when I put it away, which is a good feature. I mean, there's probably plenty I haven't picked up. That was nice, that. I didn't think for a second I'd tag that guy in the head, but uh, I did, and it gave me an arrow back, which is pretty useful. I was like, it's never going to work. The universe does love to prove me wrong. Every time I say, that's not going to work, it'll work. And I'm like, this will totally work, and then it doesn't. So, I don't know. Oh. I can upgrade the clan armor, but I doubt I can do both that and the sword. So I'm probably going to upgrade the sword. It feels like I take no damage other than particular circumstances. Like the, the guys with the big axes, they're about the only ones who can really give me some trouble. I think. Oh, what's in here? It's in the box! Uh, supplies? That's literally it. Okay. I do want to get the end of this game and we'll get, like, disowned because we fought dishonorably by stabbing people in the back despite the fact it was the most expedient way to win. <laughs> oh, yes, I got this, this reward thing for the, um... Uh, the banners. Um, oh, so that's the guy we've got to go to. Oh, okay, there's a swordsmith there as well. Okay, so we won't have to go all the way back to the Golden Temple. That's handy. Right, more looting.
Ah, uh, good old floor iron. No, got knives, got plenty of those. I think we've got most of it, I think. Or it's stuff we can't carry any more of. Okay then. Um, that's annoying. There isn't a fast travel option to get. Well, actually, no. We can go back to the camp. That works. Okay. Let's go to the. Oh, I don't want to. Okay, I'm gonna avoid that because I don't want to do the main quest just yet. So what we're actually gonna do? We're gonna go all the way back to the temple anyway. So we might as well do that. Let's go see. We shouldn't trigger automatically, should it? Yeah, okay, we have to speak to Yuna, but that shouldn't trigger automatically. I hope. I'll probably save that until the next time I stream. Um, Bored, where are you going? Ah, okay, this is the banner guy. You got clan banners? I have. I was just reading a scroll on the history of clan Adachi. It is said their first lords were known as the Great Builders. Do you know why? They constructed the Golden Temple of Ariake, and the lighthouses you see across the island. Lord Adachi even helped my uncle improve the fortifications of Clan Shimura's ancestral castle. They also had a talent for destroying structures, which helped end the Yarikawa Rebellion. I had no idea. Thank you for the lesson, my lord. Your efforts are greatly appreciated. Take care. Okay, Cloudless Dash. Saddle is said to feel like gliding across a clear sky. The saddles actually do anything? Oh, they're just cosmetics. Ah, uh, okay. I mean, they all look relatively similar. It's like variations of blue and gold, but I'll take it. Uh, right. Swordsman is to my right. Swordsman. Swordsmith! I am the swordsman. There's a difference. Oh, that's the armor. Oh, nearly killed myself. That would have been impressive. Um... Yeah, I think I'm going to do the sword. I think it's going to be the primary thing. If I can remember where he is. Yeah, merchant's there. Armor is around the back. Trapper's there. Where's the actual swordsmith? Don't worry. They'll keep Lord Shimura alive. How do you know? He's the most powerful man on Tsushima. They can use him to negotiate. I think the giveaway would be the guy hammering the metal, but apparently not. It's the bloody swordsmith. I did have... I did, for some reason in this location I go completely mad and forget where the swordsmith is. That's the trapper. That's the merchant. Were they lying to me? Or is he over here? I'm literally on top of where he should be. Hmm. Oh, or is this him down here? Okay, apparently he's decided that he's not here. Well, that's awkward. Interesting. Well, it said there was a swordsmith here, but I feel it's lying. I mean, there was the guy we rescued. It was what's her face's brother. But um, I don't know where he is.
It could be easy to spot. No, apparently not. That's just weird. Oh, wait, no, I think he's with Yuna, which is actually down here. I have to be careful not to talk to her because I don't want to launch the quest. Oh, my word. What a bimble. What a bimble. In fact, is this where the bird is showing me? If in doubt, listen to the bird. Yes, because the forge is up on the hill, isn't it? Is it? Yes, god damn it. <laughs> I don't know why. I always I always forget he's up here. Excuse me, Yuna, I'm busy. Welcome no. Back. I would be honored to work on your blade, my lord. Right, so Sakai Katana. Four fifty, forty, ten, what that that's that's fine. We can do with that. Sharper than ever. Kill enemies faster. That's what you want. Apologies. You don't have what we need to do the work. Okay, so we need a lot more iron if we're going to upgrade the Tanto. Okay, Bye. that's fine. Probably means we've missed out on the armor upgrade. For the clan armor anyway, but that's fine. Right, let's go here. Servant of the people. Where are we going? Off this cliff, apparently. Oh, it's grasslands. Okay, I thought it was a cliff. That is embarrassing. Well, they weren't kidding when they said it was the grasslands. It is indeed full of grass. They named it appropriately. Get a rig along, Kage. Oh, hello. Is this good guys or bad guys? Uh, neutral guys. Okay. Any side quests? No. No, no side quests for the samurai. Apparently not. I do wonder, this guy, I'm pretty sure he was in the uh, intro. wonder whether we should have done this earlier. I don't know. A bit late now. Legend Storyteller, not worried about him. Oh wow, yeah, this place has seen better days. And there he is. Lord Sakai! That's me. Kenji, what are you doing here? Something has gone very wrong, my lord. What did you do? Nothing. <laughs> the Mongols have taken all our food. Rice, millet, fish, anything they can lay hands on. We're starving. You say we. This isn't your farm. I have been thinking about what you said. And I'm trying to help the farmers here. Where are the Mongols camped? Who knows, they show up every few days and pick up the food and cart it away. I could ambush them. It's not that simple. They've taken hostages. If we don't produce the food, it's... Oh, oh, oh. Ah! <clears throat> there sure. must be a way to find them. There is. You won't like it. I will decide that for myself. I'm going to swap out one of my proper samurai hats, I think. Come, I'll show you. They make us bundle the food. Right. Let's get a proper hat on. Proper. Okay. Yeah, I don't like the one that has the giant, like, the, the giant crescent on it. It's kind of crazy. Hero of Tsushima helmet. Let's go with the Samurai Clan helmet. There we go. Can we, can we make it match a little bit? There we go. Colour coordinated as well. All of it from this farm? The farm? 
Scavenging abandoned. Actually, I'm just gonna take my mask off as well. There you go. Problems fishing and hunting just to fill the bellies of the enemy. What brought you here in the first place? Once the Mongols connected me to you, most places got too dangerous. I thought an out of the way farm would be safer. That's my fault. Sounds about right. Oh, iron. No, linen. Like iron, but softer. Where the hell are we actually going? Oh. Food and drink for the Mongols. But the sake barrel is empty. Oh, we have to be smuggled in the sake barrel. Anger the Mongols more? Not exactly. <laughs> the barrel is very roomy. <laughs> it could hold a heavily armed heroic samurai. You know what would fit better? A flabby, flexible sake merchant. The Mongols will take the barrel to the heart of their camp. Who could do more good there? Me or you? <sighs> I don't know why I keep letting you hide me inside things. Because it works. <laughs> I like that. That's good. Yes, because he hid him inside the cart last time. And we just about got away with it. It smells like your breath in here, Kenji. Well, that barrel didn't empty itself. Get ready, my lord. Here they come. We'll dig in Pergendach. Uh, yes, yes. All yours. Take. Master Morigov. No, no, no. Uh, that's Miko. Uh, Miko is my horse. Mine. Nadamatat. Morbignik Borsov. Ow! <laughs> and they stole his horse. Miko! No! Just plan actually worked. <laughs> I've just been dumped out on my ass in the camp. That's quite funny. Oh, oh, that guy's gonna see me. I mean, this is going to be awkward. Oh, it's spotted. Ow, bloody, bloody archer, didn't notice him. Two at once, get the hang of this. He said, getting shot. All the wrong stances, Jesus Christ. Cleanest work, but I won. And I didn't quite kill him hard enough. There we go. Yeah, I thought, to be honest, being in the middle of the camp, it would be a bit difficult to, like, get all of them at once, but, you know, that works. I can't believe it. Saved. Take this food back to your farm. Give Kenji the good news. Kenji? 
Why would I give him anything but a punch in the mouth? What do you mean? He's the idiot who got us into this mess. He tried to cut a deal with the Mongols. Oh, Lord Sakai. That was amazing. Kenji, you suck his swilling piece of monkey dung. I'll handle this. Explain yourself. I might have sold the Mongols food, but given them straw and wood chips instead. To make a profit? To save the farmer's food. You didn't think the Mongols would notice? Mm, not so quickly. All of a sudden, it was punishment, hostages. Give us food or we kill you. I was wrong to encourage you to make yourself useful. What? No, no. No, you weren't wrong, Lord Takai. I can do good. I just need practice. Try not to practice when people's lives are at stake. Yes, my lord. But the facial expression my guy had was literally just as, I have had enough of your ship. Stop fucking around. Ah. <laughs> uh... Charm of well-being. I think I've already got one of those. That samurai spared you, Kenji. I'm sorry, Taro. I was trying to help. You want to help? Choke on a rice ball. <laughs> I can tell you don't want to talk about this right now. Absolute liability. Love it. Um. Oh, we're here now. Oh, wow. Yeah, we got uh, transported like halfway across the map. Okay, I am going to bring things to a halt there. Seems like a good spot. Just finish that quest. That's awesome. So let's put a manual save in. Goodbye, oh, boy. There's always there's always one guy that's complete liability, isn't there? It's amazing. Set yourself on fire and mate with a Mongol bomb. <laughs> I don't think he's very popular right now. They've, they've just said, right off with you, sir. He's like, I, I go now. Oh dear. Okay. Anyway, like I said, I'm gonna bring things to halt there. Um, you can find all my assorted links and stuff, goodness like that, in the description. Please check it out. Thank you very much for watching, and uh, I will catch you next time.